Alrighty folks, we're back for another freaking video. Look at look at this haircut. Shoot me a subscription just for this haircut. This is epic shit. Epic shit. Um, so today I have an idea. We're gonna do 50 from 100. So we're gonna do 10 groups of five arrows at 100 yards at a paper plate. We're gonna see how I do. So, haven't shot at all. This is gonna be cold bore. Cold bore. Let's see how we do. Um, so it's game time. Haven't shot. Um, 50 from 100. So this is group number one. And I'm going to edit this kind of quick because I want this video to not be more than 10 minutes. And 50 arrows is a lot. So we're going to... I'm going to edit it kind of tight. But we will show every group. So here we go. Shot one. Pretty good. That one was good. A um, little bit jittery from caffeine, but not bad. There's no wind. Yeah, we're, might be one of the better groups I've done actually. So this is group number one from 100. It started at 9.25 a.m. So we're gonna see how long this takes. There's one other guy shooting. So a smidge left, but like pretty happy with that. I mean, that's a that's small group, really small group. And uh, just a touch left. So really, really happy with that for group one. I mean, that's a normal size plate. And those were all about you know about they would have filled about that much of the plate so really good first group let's do it again group number two Ooh. right in the center that's going to be high i didn't mean to break that one off Cool. All right. So we went two in the plate again. Two right here, just out, and one just out. So we're hovering right around this plate, which is pretty good. Um, we got eight groups to go, and so far I am four of ten in the plate, and then a friggin' bunch like just out. But let's see if we can't get uh, get those numbers up. Let's do it. All right, group number three. Um, see how it goes. Low. Late. Just low. Feeling good. Feeling really, really good. It's just that plate is so small with this distance, but we're right around it every time. I almost feel like I'm a touch low on my tape. Like maybe I should add a yard, but it's like I'm so close. Plate. Put three in the plate there. Um, and all three that hit the plate, I felt like I held a, like on the top of the plate. Um, might be a yard off on the tape. I. My bow's fast, so um, I actually have to tape at 95, not at 100, and it's really good, but I'm wondering if I should maybe put it to 96. So we'll go look and think about it. I just, I don't really want to switch because I know where it's hitting right now, so I might just kind of aim accordingly, which I normally wouldn't do, but for this video, I might just hold where it needs to be. So we'll see. See, ones like this kill me. Just out. This one, whatever, that's a ways out. That was the first shot. Um, so anyways, three in the plate. First time we've got over half, even though I've been friggin' extremely close every time. So, uh, stay down there. There we go. 
go. All right, let's do it. Group four. Uh, that is two plus two, four, seven. Seven of 15 in the plate right now. So not bad. A little less than half. Hopefully we can get those numbers up right here. And we'll keep it going. Group number four. I'm not going to move my tape, but I am going to hold the top quarter of that plate and a click just a slight bit right in the plate, just like the two o'clock. Plate. Yeah, so I'm holding right in the two o'clock of that plate. And it seems to be putting it in there. I think that's plate. Plate. Wind is definitely picking up just a hair. Not much, but when you're shooting this far, you know, you do feel it. Plate. Nope. Ah, I rushed it and pulled that one. Dude, I thought I had this one. Shit. Well, can't count that. You can count these. This one I pulled. This was the last shot. So what does that put us at? It puts me at 10. 10 for 20. Exactly half in the plate and then a bunch out like if this was if this was like a like one of those like I guess you would call them like a turkey plate which like about the size of elk vital like that's a mule deer vital or smaller that's like a coos deer vital and we're 10 for 20 in the in the plate and if that was like a like an elk vital it would be 20 for 20 all of them would be in there you know happy with that Definitely want to keep improving. Let's get on to group number five, halfway. It's a little windy, headwind, but still got to get our 10 groups. Group number five. Plate. Yeah. If I put the pin right on two o'clock, it's good. Maybe. Like Oh, nope. I didn't mean to break that one off, so it's gonna be high. Plate. Plate. Be in the plate? This was the one I didn't mean to break off. Up high, I wasn't quite on yet. And then this one, just about a centimeter out. So pretty happy with that. Three more in the plate, um, which puts me at 13 for 25. So, not bad, let's keep it going. Group six. Plate. 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 I think that's five for five, I'm pretty sure. That would be the first one at all five been really freaking close like I hate saying that because it feels like I should have a few of those but uh, we'll see we'll see it sounded like five so it's easy to shoot at 100 okay make a video doing it see how many times you put it in the plate at 100 first one all five there's smack in there other than this one so I'm happy with that I'm aiming right about here just holding the pin my pin doesn't really move so it pretty much just sits there and uh, off so pretty happy with that it was a little windy but we're we're good so that raises um we are 18 for 30 18 out of 30. group number seven Coming up. i think that's the edge of the plate Nice. All right, so we got four more. These two barely, but they're they're definitely notched the plate. This one, I should have brought a bigger plate. If I brought a bigger plate, I would have like significantly more, but. Um, okay, so that was at 18 for 30, so now I'm at 22 for 35. 22 out of 35. Let's get on to group number eight.
plate. Number eight, um, four in, one out. Um, pretty happy with that. Um, so that is 26 out of 40. We got two groups to go, which is good because not pain, but I'm definitely starting to feel a little bit of fatigue in my right shoulder pulling that 72 pound hammer. Um, but bow shooting awesome. Shout out to the bow shop for setting that thing up feels great and uh, we got two more groups so I got nine and ten ten more arrows hopefully I can go ten for ten let's see two groups ten to go well, I can't shoot with shades I always <laughs> wished I could but I can't looks so badass though oh boy Twenty-nine is for thirty. Thirty should be thirty. Number nine at a hundred. This was shot one. The wind was really blowing, and I just kind of drifted. It was obviously my fault, no excuse. But that was the first arrow. Then we put four right in the pump station, so that puts us at. 30 arrows in the plate from 100 yards out of 45, 30 out of 45. We got five shots to go, so see how we do. Wow, no, it's a bad shot. One. Close on a good one. So that should be three out of three out of uh, ten, or three out of five. Fifty arrows. Let's see how we do. Yeah, and should have had a bigger plate. This one's just out. This one I didn't mean to break. I wasn't quite ready, and it went off. So that's usually my process: is bring the print pin down. So I did that about two, maybe three times today. Um, but that's going to bring the total. 100 yards, 50 arrows. It took 50 minutes, by the way, exactly 50 minutes. Um, gonna finish out at 33 out of 50, at 100 in the plate. If it was like a little bigger plate, like a turkey plate or a tray, would have been almost all of them. So, really happy with that. Go ahead and like and subscribe and then tell me how much better you are than me in the comments. And uh, I'm excited to read them, so. See you guys in the next one.